this little creature and its comrades invaded and are overrunning parts of Spain. The Asian hornet has no natural predators. Viruses and parasites keep their distance. Meanwhile, honeybees are taking a beating and butterfly numbers are also down. Marrying technology with insecticides, humans make a declaration of war. For the nests, we use this drone. We have no limit of height. We fill the projectiles with the product, perform a flight in front of the nest at 10 or 15 meters distance, and shoot the projectiles with a success of 90, close to 100 percent. The drone is a flying exterminator of sorts, and without this technology, the future looks grim for Spain's less hostile flying creatures. The nests are our target. The queens are at the nest, and it's where the rest of the colonies are, thousands of subjects. Each nest can potentially generate for the next year around 200 new queens that will hibernate during winter and come out again the next spring. Members of the beekeeping community say the Asian hornet threatens their livelihood. This plague would affect the beekeeping industry in a very decisive way. It's affecting us right now, and it's a very serious plague. Our country is the main honey exporter of Europe. We're the main honey producers. Experts say time is running out. It's mandatory to control this plague. Mandatory. Each nest can generate between 50 to 100 new nests, so the year after the increase is exponential. For example, in Quambra last year we had between 60 and 90 nests, and this year we have more than 500. The Asian hornet migrated from China through France before landing in Spain. While groups teach frontliners how to neutralize the nests, flying drones may be the key to winning the war against the invasive pest. Arash Arabasadi, VOA News.